three stand at the edge of the school we're fucking down oh this is ah we's back and it's very depressing thing now it's really good welcome back to okay D D M E. am uh -huh. gonna hear somebody in the freaking background because that's my brother so Bye-bye! If you didn't hear him, he said bye-bye. Okay, so, um, Alright, let's just, uh, get ready. Okay, so where we left off, I remember that. Okay. Hey guys. The club is almost over. Are you two almost finished up here? Oh, um, freaking research. Research. Oh, oh, yeah. We're pretty much done. So, what do you mean? Our, or, since uh, yeah, we're uh, done. <laughs> uh, Alright, you two should probably okay, start packing so up the things now. I would hate if you were here, if you were late uh, getting home. Oh yeah, completely forgot. I need to have Natsuki go to your mother's house tonight. How did I even forget that? Mm, no! Oh, I'm alright. I'm Thanks for uh, the heads up, Monica. Um, we'll be on our way now. No problem, and, Storm. Uh, I stand up and go over to the desk where my backpack is. As no, I open no, no, the backpack, no, no. I oh, check to that. make sure that I have everything in there. That uh, yep, that exactly. looks like all of it. I glance at Mitsuki, who is still once. sitting down on the ground, staring at the wall. I don't know. I throw my backpack over my shoulder and walk over to Natsuki. Well, Natsuki? Oh, hey, Storm. What do you want? I was just seeing if you're ready to walk home. Uh, because, fine. yeah I know. We should probably get going sooner than later. Yeah, okay, I understand. Dude, she's so... She's so mad right now. And I don't know why. Don't be mad right now. <laughs> okay, continue. She stands up and yeah, grabs the things off her desk and shoves them into her backpack with no organization. She tries to zip up her backpack but it's cut on the fabric. I hate when that happens. Like you you're um Okay, so there's two things that can happen. Like you put you can put like a shirt or your um gym pants or something, maybe your jacket and it gets stuck on there and you have to pull it back like multiple times. Or get stuck like okay so you know like where the zipper is? And then those little flabs that kind of like blend, make it blend in with the thing. You can to get stuck in that, and that is a pain in the butt. I'll walk over to her and pull the zipper loose again. Go away. <sighs> okay. Oh, Sorry, just trying to help. She finishes zipping her backpack and throws it over her shoulders. Okay, let's go. Joked. <clears throat> We both walk outside without saying goodbye to anyone else in the clubroom. Are you okay, Natsuki? Yeah, what do you ask? I just wanted to make sure because you have to go to your mom's house. You're okay with that, right? It's not your business, so I mean, it kind of is because, like, I'm walking you and, like, whatever. This yeah. isn't family. It, this is a family issue. Let me deal with this. What do you even mean? It's not like... Yeah, it's not like I'm the one that suggests this to you in the first place. I like Natsuki, but sometimes she can come off really seriously, seriously rude. Well, I just thought that I could help because I don't want you to have to deal with this alone. Just always remember that I'm here f for you if you need someone to talk to you. Yeah, whatever. Bro, it's not that big of a deal. I'll be fine. Wait. Okay, so in the other streams, I think it was number two, uh, in episode two or three, uh, we go up to, I'm, I'm believing it's two, we go up to the janitor's room and go up to the roof, and he was like, yeah, Natsuki would enjoy this. Why not go there, just just for a little bit. Okay, good. I just wanted to make sure. Okay. Don't forget so, to text me tonight to make sure that you're doing okay. Um, 
What are you saying to her? I'm 18, I can handle things on my own. Yeah, but like, whatever. Hey, even 18 year olds need help sometimes. You're weird. <laughs> well, that was a lousy attempt to brighten the mood. Continue walking outside. The walk was normal as usual. Other than that, Suki being sort of secret. She stopped showing emotion recently. And that's kind of scary to me because, you know. Last time we saved her freaking life. Considering how long she wanted to keep this a secret deep inside. Ugh. Alright, Natsuki. Make sure you get in contact with me tonight. Uh, Sleep tight. <sighs> what? You never played yeah, Tuber Simulator? What? No promises. Bro. She runs away with a smile on her face. Oh, okay. She was joking. I hope she texts me. Because I'm going to be worried all night long if she doesn't. You're going to be worried for your life if she doesn't. Either way, I'm not sure if I'm getting much sleep tonight anyway. Well, I guess I need to start trying. I begin walking towards my house. Yeah, I don't care if I mess up on that last sentence. Okay. Better get to bed. I'm gonna have to try to get as much sleep as tonight as possibly can. I'm not even really hungry. Might as I might have to do something with how much I worried recently. I'm just going to no. sleep on the couch tonight. I can't no. be bothered to go get ready for bed. Bro, my grammar is straight on today or tonight. I do that in the morning. I did the same thing last night. It's not big of a deal. I picked up the remote and start flipping through the channels looking oh, you, for something to watch. Serious? Eh. Nothing really looks all that entertaining. I just put something on random. Like, even this one will do. I'm not gonna watch it anyways. I lay down on the sofa, got raised in my head. Oh, look kind of hey uh, on the pillow couch. It's okay. Please be a knock, knock, knock. Um, the way go, do do do. Slowly, I feel my eyes starting to the open again. Ooh, okay. Why can't I just fall asleep all night? I pick up my phone off the couch of the I pick up my phone off of the coffee table to look at the time. 3 a.m. My god. It's 3 a.m. and I still miss Natsuki. Not that you can hear me or anything. Why am I even talking to you directly? Yeah, there's no way I can fall asleep like this. There's got to be something I can do in the meantime. I look around the room to see if there's the, anything that catches my eye. The, the guitar is resting on the other edge of the coffee table. I mean, I guess I could make a song. Yeah, I knew I was just going to no. say about Nisuke. Um, Natsuki. Um, no. Maybe that will help with these feelings. I pick up my guitar and start doing Eh. Doesn't sound too bad. I'll just start playing in the background to some lyrics. God, I'm not... Good at writing lyrics, but you're good at poetry. Like, bruh. Even if I can't write a poem. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I was thinking about the original. If I can't even write a poem, how am I meant to write song lyrics or lyrics to a song? Whatever. Let me see what's on my mind and hope that it comes out right. Of course, I'm scared sometimes. Would I be thinking straight if I wasn't? Wait, is he seeing? Let's see. Um. Okay, go to um, your, um. Go to your settings. Hold up. Go to um. Uh, subscription. All right, so let's see. Your method. Let's see if I can find something that matches this. Or switch plans. Let's see. Um. The idea that DNA controls our life is incorrect. Science was seeking the physical...
Alright. Hopefully this he's singing. Okay. Of course. I'm scared. Sometimes. Yeah, you only have a discount. Would I be you know, thinking you know, straight if I wasn't? Even if I say it, don't phase me. Or if I say it's not hazy. I mean, I guess that's okay. Hoping that TV likes this, eventually I want her to hear it, what I mean. Okay, enough. Enough with this ugly music. I, I try, guys. I'm truly sorry. I very truly am. Okay. After all, what's the point of writing a song about someone if they never going to hear it? Okay, I need to go to bed. I literally made an entire song about Natsuki in the time that I need to go to sleep. I check on my phone. 4.30. So you spent an hour and a half making a song. Honestly, that went by pretty fast. I can make an entire song in an hour and a half. Not too bad. I guess when I'm having fun, time flies by. But for real, I need to get to sleep. I... I saw my guitar. Wait, I'm a... I'm a... I'm at music now? A lot. Okay, I set my guitar down and lay back on the couch and try to fall asleep again. But you're not gonna. You, uh, you're to fall asleep. Listen to the heartbeat. Go to sleep. Now the scare sounds in the dark. I don't want... Oh. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, is it the phone? Ah, uh, I turn over to shut off my alarm. God dang it. Thank God I remember to set up an alarm or else I would be late for school today. At least I got some sleep this time, I swear. That's a rarity point at this. At this point. Oops, sorry guys. I screwed up my grammar. That means I'm never going to be able to return. I don't know what... Yep, I can't return. Okay, I don't know... What about being at the club makes me s makes it so hard to get some sleep? Of course, I wasn't putting the bl blame on the girls, but I had lots more stress lately. And then I wouldn't trade it for anything. I'm so glad that Terry invited me to join this club. Damn, I do owe her something. I should do something nice for her today, just to let her know how much I appreciate her. Especially after yesterday, something wasn't right there. I wouldn't want to want somebody as important as Harry to think I don't like her. I get up off my bed. Oh yeah, I still need to write a poem for today and take a shower to get ready for school yeah. since I didn't last night. Hopefully I'm not late. I need to make sure I get out there this Saturday in time. I don't want to put any more burdens on her that I don't need today. <laughs> Burden. I think that's what that says. I'm probably gonna look back at this video and say, That's not burdens, you stupid piece of. I might as Wait. well get ready first since it doesn't make that much sense. That makes. I woke up serious in my bathroom. Alright. Time to write something what down. Mm. What should I write about this time? Almost in my opinion should be about feelings, either your own or somebody else's. And right now, I'm mostly worried about that too, can Sayuri. I don't know what's wrong with Sayuri at this point. At least I know what Natsuki is going through. I guess I'll write something about Natsuki. Hopefully it's okay to write a poem for a specific person in the club. In the club. I don't think that Monica will care. Well, she might, but... I'm sure she'll be nice about it. I just Give start writing down words God that express my feelings for Natsuki. I hope that speak. it makes something cohesive, I think. After a couple of words, I look down on the paper and begin reading it to myself to make sure it makes sense. Mm-hmm. 
That's pretty powerful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what she said. Hopefully I get this through to Natsuki and tell her how I really feel about her. It's gonna be so hard to show her this at the club. Hopefully none of them will find out that I wrote this for Natsuki. Plus, her writing is pretty straightforward. So me copying her style should be pretty obvious. Nope, I gotta fix my mic. There we go. <sighs> I just have to push through and do it anyways. I've got to let her know something or else she's never gonna know. Oh, what time is it? I look at down at the clock in the microwave. It's 7.30 a.m. Oh, it reads 7.30 a.m. It's time to go or else I'll be late for a Saturday. One last thing. I want to write... I was right now more problems. I didn't... I took... Oh, I thought he said I didn't take the poem. I was like, oh, you stupid. No. You're gonna forget it and Monica's gonna be mad and you're gonna be sad. But uh, I take the poem and put it in a neater pocket in my back pocket. My backpack. Then I did before so it's not as full. Yeah, uh, like piece paper. Hopefully this one will work better. I unzip my backpack and throw it over my shoulders. You can do this one. I walk outside and hope that Terry is out there waiting for me. I would hate to walk outside only to see oh. that she isn't there for some weird reason. I step outside. Where is she? I quickly look around to, work to see where she is. You're not outside you're, you're not, you're in her not, front door, which she usually is. Oh no, inverse. what I'm happened? You my mind starts racing at the possibilities again. of where she could be, what, what she could have done was that. Oh my god. What about if she hung herself? I walk hey, forward get back, get back, and uh, glance get back, at the. Get back, get back. I walk forward and glance down at the street to see where she's gone. As I see, I wait. As I look, I see Sarah so walking down our usually path about 30 feet down. Hey! I yell. He keeps walking for a second hey, and seems like she takes a deep breath, then turns around and looks at me and gives me a smile. Oh, she's wrong. I begin fast walking over to her. I thought that you were late again. Wait, why okay. did she take a deep breath? Okay. Like, does she not want to be near me right now? Did she run off? Have I gone? Back. Have Back. I really gone Back. this reputation now for always being late? That I turn into Sai? I mean, I guess it's not untrue, but oh. I don't want to be known as that person anymore. I guess I almost was but here i am now are you ready to have a good day today i brought a poem this time i almost sound too positive at this point heh <laughs> yeah i guess so seeing you happy isn't enough for me oh is enough for me is enough for me i read that wrong i'm sorry guys i was like what that's good Cool. I know that I change your mood. Heh. <laughs> Trust me. You've been able to do that entire time. I I mean Oh? A little weird. I really hope I just misunderstood her point there. If that truly if that's true I need to make sure that I make up for whatever I've done to her. Oh really? Heh. <laughs> I have so much more power now. You sure do, Storm. It's fine, Sadie. I would never do anything bad to you on purpose. I've been friends for almost two decades. Not everyone can say that about somebody. Yeah, I remember those days. Back when we used to dig up dirt and eat the worms, you know, go fishing, and, you know, instead of we hang the worms, the worms hang us on the stop. <laughs> Sometimes when I think about the past, it feels like I'm 
taking a bat being swung against my head. You know, I took the bat and hit the ball, but instead of... But the, the ball's coming at the bat, and it hits his head on it, and the bat is me. For some reason, it hurts so much. I need to stop making these puns, but, you know. I feel the same way, too, sorry. Except, for me, it's like a metal bat. Bruh. No, a metal one that flies in the air. Not, not the thing that you hit the ball with. Storm, I was being serious. Ow. <laughs> yeah, I know. Hey, I hey, feel like... No, 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 that's a bad. I feel like... I feel that way sometimes, too. But dwelling on the past does nobody good. Sometimes you just need to move forward and forget oh. it's ever happened. Yeah, you hypocrite. You're such a hypocrite. You've been dwelling on Diary and she- I mean, not sorry, um... Not Natsuki and she hasn't even left. Yeah. Well, so much for lightening the mood. As you said, you know, maybe yesterday. Whatever. I think she'll be okay, plus we've been friends for so long. She would tell me something's really bad. Let's no. get going to school. We can't be late. Of course not. Okay. Begin walking oh. slightly faster to school. Hey, don't, what if my life has become at talk this me? point? It's been hell, that's what. I'm yeah. just trying to make sh sure all my friends are mentally okay. I don't have any room to be careful for myself. If you think about the people well, I get. you think about it, I guess life is only meant for coffee, people, coffee, other I dare people. You. I dare you. If you think about it, I guess life is only meant to please other people. So I guess I'm doing the right thing. Whatever, stop thinking too deep into it, Storm. Everything is going to be okay. Not really. Me and Terry arrived to her Freaking class. Have a good day, Sai. Thanks, Sai. Thank you. I see you in class. Well, I'm the problem to you later. Hehe. <laughs> I might miss it. I don't feel good today Freaking so far. I really hope she's being truthful with me right now. Okay. If you do, make sure to text me so I know if you're feeling okay. Ammo. Whatever what? you say, Storm. No, you know I'm, I'm just gonna the take the rope, my put it around my neck, tie it to the ceiling, and hang myself. Yeah, no, never mind. Back up. See you later. Have a great rest of your day. Bye. So we don't have any classes together. That's depressing. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Yep. Uh, I have to go to a literature club. Good old school. Tell me about it. Hyper normal as usual. Other than what's happening with Sai, sometimes I recent I really think about how I got myself into the situation I'm in. Like, what could I, what could I have done in the past to fix this Ooh. unusual? I know I haven't been the most nicest person to Sai lately, but Sorry, I would general. think about how it affect this much. If I'm even the problem in the first place, who knows? Maybe it's a secret between the girls, and I'm the only one that doesn't know about it. Well, 
you know, you gotta remember what uh, Natsuki oh, said at the beginning. Really? You brought a really? boy, I... like, yeah. bro. If that was the case, then I would think you they really would eventually right tell me what's going on, considering how close I've gone to each of the club members in just a week. About that, too, I think I've been focusing on Natsuki too much. It's unfair that I only talk to Natsuki when the other girls need me, too. Bro, no, Natsuki is life. I see that I, like I'm some sort of... I don't know what that word is. You probably don't even think about me that much. I'm most likely just another di distant friend to them. Especially Monica. She seems super popular and I doubt she would waste her time on somebody like me. Eh, anyway, I better get going to the club. Please. I need to see Sari if, if she's coming or not. I haven't gotten a text yet, so I assume she is. I pick up I my school supplies guard. and head out into the class. I've memorized where to go at this point. Yeah, because for the past three days, no, four days, you've forgotten. You will not. Not. Okay. Not quite sure why it took me so long to do so, but at least I know where I'm going now. I approach the clubroom doors. I see Monica in the front of the room shuffling papers around like usual through the window. At this angle, I can't see if any of the other girls are in there yet. Only one way to find out. I open the doors. I glance around the room to see who's here. No one. Only Monica? A little weird. This is about to be awkward. I assume they're just late. Yeah, okay. Hey, Monica. Glad to see you made it here early. Thanks. Bad boy, bad boy. I didn't even notice down, that I was down. early. Well, you're not very early, but the other club members are just sort of late. Oh, yeah, I assume so. Yeah, okay. Do you know why? Did they text you or something? No, I haven't heard anything from them. But trust me. Oh, uh, <laughs> but I trust my club members. They won't do something without telling me. Plus, I know a lot about them. Probably more than they think I do. That's creepy. Yeah, that's a little creepy. But I let it pass by. Wouldn't be the first time, I guess. He's always been kind of weird. Oh, really? How long have you known them for? I met them around my first week of high school, so almost four years now. Please don't tell me Monica's evil and she deleted them. How did it Please don't know? tell me. In that time, we've really gotten to know each other very well. This is the only reinforce my assumption that they're not telling me something serious is going on. I don't think that what she meant by it, but it didn't help. Well, maybe she did. She is pretty creepy after all. No, I don't think so. If anyone would do that, it would be Yuri. I don't know why well, she seems to like the know. type of person to spy on people and not tell other things. Assuming assumptions are beautiful things. Wow, that's amazing that you know that you've been able to build such a close relationship in that time. Some people just end up being distant friends instead. Yeah, you still it's always too. It's always a lot of fun to me to be around. Them, then I think they are. Okay, that's awesome. I mean, Alright, I guess I'll be on my things out in the meantime. Good idea, Storm. I walk over to my usual desk and Whoa. set my backpack down on top of it. Or on top of it, whatever. As I unzip my bag, I notice Monica's writing something down on a piece of paper. Are you rewriting your poem right now? That's evil. It doesn't seem like a very leaderly thing. I love assumptions. I quietly giggle to myself. 
As I finish getting out my supplies, I hear people chatting from outside of the clubroom door. So the door swings open. Natsuki and Yuri talk together. I don't think I would ever see that day to come. Two such different personalities getting along. Crazy. Welcome, Yuri and Natsuki. Glad to see you showed up. Thank for being late, Monica. Dude, it wasn't on purpose. Don't we you just dare. Uh, don't you got dare. caught up I'll on a discharged. conversation. Why do you look guilty? I will get you Natsuki quietly looks at Monica and gives Yuri a few uh, quick glances as she talks. Uh, what did they talk about? Did I be worried? It's totally fine. I don't okay. want this club to have you dominate dominate your Sorry. life anyway. Sorry. Yes, you do. In the original Sorry. game, Sorry. yes, you do, Sorry. because you know you freaking murder them. Never. But when you can, make sure you make, uh, show up on time. Of course, I would nope. hate to make what your you life mean? any harder than I, it I needs to be. Thank How you, Yuri. Natsuki seemed a little nervous and a little suspicious. Not sure why, though. I would like to share poems in a different way today. We have something coming up soon. That I, I, oh, is it the festival? Are we going to have to present why it in front of everybody at up? once? Turn, What's going on, Monica? Turn your F off. Uh, turn so, your I let, I let you know once Harry gets here oh. just so that everyone... The, the door swings open once again, so he runs in out of breath. Sorry, I was Sorry. late, Monica. What? Why are they all late? That's so weird. What? What were they discussing? Also, it's cool. Um, in the first game, it says that she's, you know, always a mess. And as you can see, like, you can see the little, I guess, ties thing. They're all, like, nice. And then hers is just loose. I had to finish up some work in my last class. That's right, sorry, I have an announcement to make. Anyway, I was going to wait for you, but you're right just in time. Oh, yay. What do we have planned? Yuri and Natsuki looks at Monica with confusing, confused and focused expressions. So next week we're going to have a literature festival called it. Where students will come up and read their poems off like they prepared to do the club. And we oh, can read our yeah. poems to set an example. So prepare for that. I thought that we could all kind of share poems out loud today. Sari and Wook stun and Yuri Knife turns off. away. Nope, <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. I've already, I'm already bad enough with writing poems. I don't need to present one in front of people that I, I don't I'm even not, know. I'm, I'm not even. Because who wants to do that? That's insane. <sighs> That's easy. Can I go first? Eh. Well, actually, I thought I could go first. Just to set an example for you to follow. Is that okay? Uh, if you insist, I guess so. God, why you gotta mean, mean to Natsuki? Good. So everyone gather around in the front desk. As I start walking forward, I notice that Balsari and Yuri are hesitant to go to the front desk. I glance back at Sari, who looks very nervous, as they both stay silent. I'm sort of worried for them, oh, no. especially Sari. Oh no! I wish I was. She seems like 
she was having a difficult day yesterday. I don't think she really needs this right now. And Yuri is not the type of person to go up and present to a group of people at all. I continue forward while Yuri and Yuri follow. Okay, so I guess I'm the line leader. Yuri sits the desk adjacent to me, and Yuri sits next to Natsuki. Wait, right, here goes nothing. Um, we all look forward to uh, giving Monica our undivided attention. Wait, 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 this poem wait, is called wait, Just Like wait, You. Yeah. I'm just going to let you guys read this. Yuri reference? What? Alright. Uh, Sari taps my shoulder and begins to whisper to me, trying to have Monica not notice her conversation. Don't remember how I said I didn't feel good yet? Do you, are you not feeling so well? Yeah, and I don't think Monica will like my poem. Can you check it out? Just to make sure it's not horrible? Yeah, sure. She hands me her poem. Ah. Oh. 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 Wait. Um. Uh, um. That's beautiful. That's. Okay. I'm going into right now, um, the game files, but I don't see anything about poems. Yeah, I don't see anything right now. Um, okay. Trace back. Huh. That's a uh, strange. I I I love it. it Wait, inverse. You two, yeah, okay. Well, I'm gonna take a screenshot of this, and then you know, um, in the next episode, I'm gonna tell you what it says. Or maybe in this episode, you'll get to see. Um, this is just a bunch of gibberish. This is a joke, sorry. Oh, um, no, I thought it was good. I guess I can bring it home and switch it around if you want me to. I mean, I guess you could... If I'm just confused. I'm sorry, Storm. I'll make a better one tomorrow for you. I'm going to leave. I think I've got to... Use... Hold up. Let me figure out what this says. Alright. Never mind. Also, deja vu. Tell me, Monica, that... I didn't feel good. I'm going oh, to have no, to leave. No, no. Um, something kind of happened. All right, she stands up quickly, grabs her backpack, and leaves the room. But and before I can formally get a good response, did that do that? No, please don't crash on me. Oh wait. Monica is zoomed into her poem to notice that Siri just left. Yep, I don't know what that is. Hold up. I'm just save. And 
the load. Oh, I swear to God. Man, this. Go to load. Go here. I don't know why that's there. You and that's RMP just me. Oh my God. Yuri and Atsuki glance at me with confused expressions. I don't know, I whisper. They shrug off and continue listening to Monica's presentation. Am I the only one that is a little freaked out by this? This isn't normal for someone to check I'm getting out uh, RGR one. You know, uh, RGR. Oh, the end. Uh, they began to start clapping. I turn and I start clapping. Just like that. You can practice before the festival all you want. But this is a good presentation now. Who wants to go? Oh, I do. Nes Natsuki quickly jumps out of her seat. Okay, go ahead, Natsuki. <laughs> um. I hear it. Yuri takes an exhale. Yuri should be fine. She needs to get over her general stage fright. I know she's an amazing writer. She does. She doesn't think so. Natsuki stands at the front of the desk with. I don't know. Monica and Natsuki sit in the front row. The poem is called Catch. Caution tape around my heart. I'll uh, let, let her read. You guys can read this. Okay, go oh really quick. Despite being so excited, I could tell Natsuki's you face is a me. little red and she realizes where she is. I know. Her too well to know that she's getting a little nervous right hey. now. Anyway, I really need to go see where Sayuri went. As weird as she be, uh, been acting for the past few days, I don't really trust her anymore. But at the same time, I can't I leave the club early and keep I'm being late. I'm just saying, I'm just staying here and listening to the rest of the poem and leave when they're done. Um, okay, 
Thoughts comes over the room as Natsuki finishes her poem. That was good, Natsuki. You really yes, want to tell yes. me right now? Yes, 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 huh? yes, it was. Oh, you are? Uh, no, not yeah, right Natsuki, here, great job. Oh, gee, you really want Um, it could have been better. Not even wine. I think that was the best. That was better than Monica's. And this is all Monica's idea. Did Natsuki just beat Monica in her own game? Natsuki walks back to her desk. All right, which one of you want to go next? She, she's talking about. No, no, no. Uh, we still, we still talking to Yuri, Yuri and I. I glance over to Yuri to see if she has a response. She turns to me and slowly shakes her head, and yeah, I look forward again. I guess I can go he's next. Alright, turn. let's see what you have done. Monica's face lightens up with a bright smile. She's been really excited for a long time about wanting to hear one of my poems. I guess she has a right to be happy after waiting so long. Mina, like, like, it's kind of like when you order something and it doesn't arrive the day that it says it would, and then finally it arrives and you're like, finally I get this thing. But it was like a present. They are so I, I don't know. They But in the end, I don't even know what she's so excited about. I woke up to the front of my desk with my paper in hand. Alright, so this poem is called Jump. It goes nothing. I really hope they enjoy this. Cute. Fluffy. Here. Candy. Shopping. Puppy. Kitty. What in the world? Let's take... Is it, is it just... Is it... Now you know it. A very pink, chocolate, heartbeat, kiss, melody, ribbon, doki doki, and roll the credits. All right, now it's okay. You do not it's it's just mind. words. Sometimes comes. I'm speaking. Yuri stares at me with a bit confusing, confusion. But Natsuki looks amazed. That oh. that's the end. They all start giving me you a hesitant not... applause. That that was great, Man, Storm. So right. <laughs> it totally wasn't just a bunch of words that you wrote down on a piece of I paper mean, really quick and called it a poem. Oh. Very interesting word choice and style. Kind of reminds me of Natsuki. Yeah, I look. I took a little inspiration. Oh, <clears throat> a lot. The inspiration from Natsuki's writing. Oh. I thought that her style was really impressive. Yeah, there's no need to put in a bunch of complicated words just to make the point across. All those words yeah. just describe Natsuki, and she's she's smiling. Makes me feel so happy when she smiles. Monica's over here like, <laughs> right. Simple is better. Yeah, that too. Well, that's a mindset to have. All right, are you ready to go, Yuri? I look worried. I look out. I look out worried, Yuri. What? What? RGR, kill him. Um, okay. He looks back at me as I walk back to my desk. Sure, haha. <laughs> I guess I can't go next. I guess I can go next. You got this, Yuri. You're an amazing writer. Yeah, Yuri. You have nothing to worry about. Thank you. She writes at the front of the desk. This poem is called Cope. Her face gets red as she speaks. She takes a deep breath in. Alright, here you guys go.
Oh, okay. After she finishes, the entire club lights up with clapping. I look around to see Natsuki oddly clapping. She's really started to warm up the Yuri surprisingly. No, no, no. Two no. Yuri surprisingly, you mean? After them walking into the classroom oh, together, I think oh, they found oh, a no. new friendship. Oh. Anyway, I really need to go check on Sari. I don't think we have anything else more important to do in this club anyway. I stand up and walk over to Monica. Let oh. me go check on Sari and make or sure that she's okay, I whisper. She looks back and, I mean, confused while clapping. Monica walks towards where Sari used to fight. say, notice she's not there anymore. No, no, okay, no. Storm. No, no, no. Please make it quick. I have yeah. one last thing to tell the group. And if you got her, that would be nice. Alright, I'll go quick. Hopefully she's okay. I can't believe that no one notices notice she's gone. Does this group really care about her? I walk over to the door and open it. Walking outside. Oh, uh, where do I even that? check first? Do it, mm. do it. Um, I guess I should go outside to see if she's Ooh, hanging yay. out there. I mean, I guess we could go check. Um, there really isn't anywhere to go in this school, and this time she could be in the bathroom, but I wouldn't be able to get in there anyway. If she isn't outside, I guess I'll start looking around the school or in her house. I begin walking outside. Do do do. As the doors open, I feel a cold evening breeze past me. It feels peaceful out here. A place like this, I would think Sari would like. I start looking around. Hmm. I really don't see her so far. I guess she just checked around the corner. Begin walking yeah, around the corner into the grassy area. This isn't good. Why would she just randomly leave like that? It's not like she... It's not like something she would do. Unless she's just pranking us or something. But I would, I don't think she would do that, neither. I woke up hey, at the hey, school hey, trying to hey, find hey, what... I woke up at the school trying to look in the windows if I can see her. No. Oh wait. I freeze. Is there you stand at the edge of the school roof looking down? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to leave that there, guys. I'm so sorry, but this is a cliffhanger. I promise you I will get this one. Oh, okay. I just loaded it. I just loaded it. I'm sorry, guys. Ah. Okay, well, I know where to stop. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. You know what it is. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. I kind of messed up, but yeah, this is going to have to be a big cliffhanger. See you guys.